Morning everybody, how you doing? It's Steve here from Don Amot Leisure and a video from me today is of this pre-owned 2020 Eldis AutoQuest 155. So it's done just under 8,000 miles. It's on the Peugeot manual gearbox. Um, it is a four sleeping, four traveling model. It comes in at three and a half tons. It can be driven on a standard driving license and it's just over seven meters long at 7.02. So if this is something you are interested in, ask for me when you come down or when you phone. Let's have a look round first of all then. So starting off on the outside, it's in the white AutoQuest colors with the red and the gray. Looking into here and it's got AdBlue, so it's Euro 6 compliant. And then moving down the side, you've got your habitation door there. That is your LPG gas tank or locker. So that's a locker suitable for two gas tanks. And then in there, you've got a decent size storage that's accessible from the inside and the outside. So you can access that from the bed and I'll show you. Toilet cassette is there and that's all your battery box and your water point. Previous customers left the bike rack and also fitted was the rear view camera system. Down this side, it's all nice and sleek, so there's nothing really jumping out. There are your drain valves there on either end, and then you've got your fridge vents just there. So let's head on in and have a look at how lovely this is on the inside. <coughs> So no need for a habitation step or a kick out step because it is a low profile van. So you can just jump in. You've got your habitation door fly screen there. And then in there is your bin. Jumping in then. Starting from the front and working our way back. So that's your rear view camera system that you can see there. And then you've got all the things you'd expect on the front, which is Bluetooth connectivity, speed limit and cruise control, USB points and 12 volt power points here bit of extra storage in there that's connected so you can chill things down yeah. and then you've got your radio and everything so as expected all at the front twin swiveling captain seats so both of these seats will spin round a little bit of storage just here and then in terms of locker storage you've got your two there and your two there for those eagle-eyed amongst you you've gone I thought you said it traveled four people Steve how magic so if you look under here you've got your agouti traveling seats that are just tucked under there so if i drop this down you'll be able to see it a bit clearer yeah. so they all fold up and everything all sort of folds you've still got a bit of storage at the front there but that is one that side and then there is one this side as well so again if i can just open that you can see another one there with storage because they're nice long benches you do get a bit of additional storage on some of them they're shorter and the seat fills the whole gap but you do get a bit of um, a bit of storage space as well extra worktop there for your kitchen a microwave has also been added and then something i do like in the l this is this black sink and black hob because it all just looks really really smart yeah. so you've got a good sized sink your fridge is down there which is your three-way fridge three gas one electric and then a separate grill and oven and then you've got all your drawers here so there's quite a few of them all going down and then above your head here you've got your plate storage and an extra cupboard for your pots and pans plenty of power sockets so if you've got kettles air fryers etc you've got enough there in here is your wardrobe where you'll find your TV aerial and your freestanding table. So you can take your table outside if you wanted to. Mm -hmm. And then your TV bracket and your TV connectivity is at the back here. Yeah. And this will fold out so you can watch it from this side as well. And then you've got a, a door that will separate the bathroom off and the bedroom off from the front. So as I said, you can lift it up as well from the inside to unveil that massive storage space mm -hmm. that we saw that you can access from the back so there's loads of room there you got three skylights so there's one at the back here and then one above wendy's head and one at the front for nice airflow coming through and it's going to be a warm one today and i've opened them so we're not actually that hot yep. we're just lovely aren't we wend yep. and then in here you've got a decent sized wet room so you've got your toilet at the back and then a fold down sink just there like that and then extra storage above Brilliant. so you can see in there when that you've got good storage yeah. as well right. and then your shower area so all in all 
that's pretty much it. A couple of extra bits of storage across the top at the back as well. So two more lockers and two more lockers there. So um, if you're looking for a four travelling, four sleeping van that's suitable for a family, comes in at around seven metres and is still three and a half tonnes so can be driven on a standard licence, then this could be the van for you. So if you're interested, pick up the phone and ask for me, Steve, as I said, and I'd love to show you around it in person. So thanks for watching, really appreciate it. And uh, don't forget your sun cream and take care. Ta-da.